Being a finalist in the awards is, is really about getting the message out there about who I am and what the company does. And it's all about brand. And, and I think that's really important, you know, co constantly looking at um, how you can get exposure in terms of good publi publicity. The main thing about networking and, and actually building that network is all around strategy. You know, strategic networking is really important. So the worst thing you can do is go into a room and gather as many business cards as possible because what's the value chain to that? So being very targeted about what networks you're going to go to and what the value is to you. And also remember that the person that you is standing in front of you isn't necessarily the person that you need to get to. They've got a network as well. The best piece of advice given to me in, in you know, building a business is know your numbers. You know, don't be frightened of the cash flow. Don't be frightened of the figures. The most important skill I've had to learn moving forward, I think, is, is listening and drawing information from both clients and also people who are trying to give me some good advice. So I think listening is a really important skill to have in business. For those people who might be hesitant about, you know, going forward and putting themselves forward for the awards, I think the only piece of advice is to take action. The biggest risk is, is not doing it. You know, what, what's the not to love about putting your name forward for an award? And it's great, it's great exposure. It's great exposure for you as your own personal brand, but also for your businesses as well. So it's only a good thing to do.